I'm sorry, Earth is closed today. You better pack it up and get out of here. Stonekeeper, does this chattering animal speak for you? Certainly not. I speak for myself. I'm trespassing in this city and on this planet. He needs to get lost, Squidward. Hey everyone, Craig here with another Blu-ray review, and this time I am looking at Avengers Infinity War, now out on Blu-ray and 4K. So if you have missed Avengers Infinity War in theaters, I, well, first off, I don't know how you did. It has been the biggest movie of the year so far. It is the culmination of 10 years of Marvel movies, and it was just an absolute juggernaut. The Avengers finally went up against one of the greatest villains of all time, and of course, I am talking about Thanos, and it brought all of our Avengers together. Iron Man, Thor, the Guardians of the Galaxies, Doctor Strange, Bruce Banner, just everyone in the Marvel Cinematic Universe together in what is one of the greatest movies that I think in most people's opinions, not my favorite Marvel movie, but many people out there consider it one of their favorites. So uh, it's definitely something that you have to see, even if you've only seen a couple of the Marvel movies, uh, do yourself some justice, just sit through them all to get to this one and see what they were able to accomplish with it, because it really is impressive. So I'm going to just stop talking about the movie at this point because chances are you probably have seen the movie and you already know all about it. You have your feelings on it. But let's talk about the actual bonus features that you get with this movie and help you decide whether or not you actually want to pick this up and own it. What exactly is it that they do? Kick names, take ass. Yeah, that's right. My guess is, again, you probably will because you probably saw it in theaters and you're just obsessed with it. But, hey, some people out there might be on the fence about it. And uh, actually, in this case, I have to say I was disappointed with the bonus features, to be completely honest for you. Uh, it, the main bulk of it is made up of featurettes. There are a handful of them, I believe four in total, and it's Strange Alchemy, the Mad Titan, Beyond the Battle Titan, as well as Beyond the Battle Wakanda. There's nothing wrong with these little featurettes. However, uh, for a movie that was so long and was so involved, uh, it just felt very bare bones in the behind the scenes looks at the, looks at the making of the movie. So it's not that it wasn't interesting, but it just felt like there wasn't enough depth in in any of these featurettes. It, it really was uh, it just short and bare bones in that sense. Uh, of course, they had to feature a gag reel on here, which many people do enjoy gag reels. Uh, I'm not one of them because it's like watching an inside joke that you're just not a part of, so. Because you're worth it. Maybe you'll like it, maybe you won't. Uh, there are a handful of deleted scenes as well. Um, and again, I don't think any of these really add to the, the movie as a, a whole. Uh, they're just like most deleted scenes. They were cut for a reason, but hey, that's, that's just what that is. So um, they're there if you want them. Uh, the audio commentary, I did listen to all of this track and i will say again not to not to continue to sound negative but usually i'm a very big fan of audio commentaries i i love the extra insight that you get into the actual making of the film unfortunately with avengers infinity war it was on the dry side so uh it was hosted by joe and anthony russo the directors of the movie but it just wasn't super interesting, to be honest. Like, uh, there was a couple good tidbits every once in a while, but it was very dry. There, there, wasn't, there wasn't enough... Again, I don't want to keep saying that. There just wasn't enough insight involved. It, it felt like a lot of the special features were kind of aimed directly at the average person, not the not the really the big movie fan who really wants to know how this was made. But in that sense, the one featured extra that they did have that you can only get uh, when you redeem your digital copy of the movie, if you're buying a physical copy, if you're buying a digital copy of the movie, you get it right away. Uh, they do have the director's round table, and that brings together the directors from the Marvel Cinematic Universe, not all of them, just, just a, a select few of them, and 
you just get a really, really great discussion, something that I'm glad it, it was released in some way. It would have been great on the actual physical release, but as long as you're redeeming your movies digitally, you get to watch it. I'm not going to spoil anything in this one for you. You just have to watch it yourself, but absolutely take the time to uh, you know pull up movies anywhere if that's how you're redeeming it and, uh, and give this one a look because it is worth it. Uh, what is this guy's problem, Mr. Stark? Uh, he's from space. He came here to steal a necklace from a wizard. Despite the fact that the bonus features aren't, well, they're they're not really great at all, just to be completely fair about it. Um, I, I still think that it's worth picking up Avengers Infinity War. So especially if, if you're a fan of all these Marvel movies, while, it, again, it's not my favorite of the Marvel movies, I didn't think it was perfect. It is an epic movie in every sense. It was the culmination of these 10 years. It was, it, it was hyped up and for very good reasons. So it's absolutely worth picking up and putting into your collection, especially if you get all of the Marvel movies. Um, I, I think one day after the next Marvel films release that will have uh, maybe a set one day with all the Avengers movies that might go into more details in the making, but for the time being, you need to grab a copy of this so you can keep rewatching it over and over again and waiting for the next Avengers movie to come out. So, that's my thoughts on it, and if you pick it up, enjoy watching it, but until the next movie review, I will see you around. You okay? Notice you've copied my beard. Oh, by the way, this is a friend of mine, Tree. I am Groot! I am Steve Rogers. 